Hello everyone, TrueBlitz here. Welcome back to more Metroid Zero Mission. Last time we got power bombs as well as found a way to get away from well the mothership and back to back to the other back to back to criteria where we previously explored way way back early in the adventure. And now comes the part of the game that I kind of dread a little bit though. This is the part of the game where we're going to be getting a lot of stuff there because I could technically finish the game right now because you know I could just go. Do what I need to do in the next area over there in the pirate ship and trigger the sequence to get out. So, first off, you want to go. Ten of this can save later, but there's not really a good, efficient way to do this, though, because. Well, you'll see, though, because this one, this one's a little way out, a little ways out the way here. Ow. So we gotta go back with these pirates here, and and there is a there is an upgrade way way up of this way here in this direction here that. We gotta deal with. I don't. I don't like it either. But, but, and, and it's one that we have to go way out of our way for, unfortunately. I. So this is gonna take a little bit, though, and it's one that I alluded to. I I did allude to it earlier, but like I did allude to it, but the problem is though it's. Well, we needed power bombs to get it before because we had we couldn't get it in that way. So, all right. So, okay. So we're so we're through this way here. But like I said, this is a long one to get to, and I dislike it for that reason. Like I said, there's a lot of stuff that we couldn't get before though. So, so that's what part of this is gonna be. So yeah. So go go up this way here, and it's another one of those ways where the pillar was blocked off, though, where there's a there's an upgrade we could have gotten here, and that's where we're already back to where we had first saw the power bombs in the first place. There, so so this area look so this area does look familiar. So, but yeah, the, like I said, not to sound too negative though, but yeah, this is probably my least favorite part of the game. And this is why I don't always 100% this game though, because it's. It feels like more of a chore to 100% this one than it is other ones, though, because you can at least get the majority of upgrades. You can at least get just by all the upgrades as you're doing other as you're doing other stuff in the game, though. So you don't have to worry. So a lot of it is you don't have to worry about that that kind of thing, though. So all right, so power bomb this one here, and if you jump up there, it. it because you had those were power blocks as well, but over here, over here, yeah, it tells you how far back this really was. There's a missile block up. Actually, is that a missile block? Okay, no, I, I was I was right. There was a missile block, but I was off one for a power bomb tank. That the last three minute de this three minute detour here that I had to take, all for one power bomb tank. I am not happy. Actually, it may be more worthwhile just to go ahead and just go this way here, back, back in this direction here, but and just get some of the ones that I deci just decided to skip there. Yeah, go ahead and follow me, the lava pirate. What did they? What did they actually do that? I have no idea. I have no idea if they would do that. Actually, though, if they can, if they can do that. To the, to my knowledge, they don't have anything resembling gravity suit technology, but I don't know. But it's a funny, th it's just a funny thought, though. But so, yeah, I could go back this way, back to back to criteria, back to criteria this way here. But I'm gonna, since it's kind of off in this direction here anyway. What I'm gonna do is there were a couple little, there were a couple little points where I could actually well get, there's some upgrades that I skipped because I intended to pick them up on my way back here because yeah we are gonna have to come back to this area because ultimately we have to go through this area to finish the game F finish this area to finish the game but but in any case but yeah y'all die so now we're back over here I'm gonna go ahead and start getting a couple get a couple of these other upgrades that are on the way though but there is one other upgrade that's over that direction, and you remember, if you remember those speed booster blocks from before, where we have to, where we need some stuff over there. But, but up this way here, like I skipped this one earlier because I intended to get it earlier, 
because I intended to get later and I, th I went the wrong way. So this way here. And also, something to note as well, again, like, this already look, look, looks like a vessel over here and I seriously picked the wrong one again. That's what I get for not practicing this area. But super missile tank up over here. But back to what I was saying though, it was like, some people theorize that, well, well some people have some theories about this though, because, but honestly though, to be perfectly honest though, this part already looks like part of the wrecked ship here that was in, that was up over in Super, that was in Super Metroid, so. It's interesting though, but, but, but yeah, so. But, but yeah, it's like some people have like theories about what is the wrecked ship though, like if even some, some, even this, even the, the pirate ship that we see is potentially part of the wrecked ship or something, which, the developers have outright denied that, though, because, yeah. Because the pirate vessel is here, though, and there is there is remains of a ruined ship here. around here. But, in any case, but, yeah, it's not that. To my knowledge, it's not really that, though. But, now we're back in Criteria. Let's actually get to the, to the backtracking part of this game, so. Let's head on over this, cross over this way here, and... We're gonna start off in one area that where you probably wouldn't have thought there were upgrades. Oh, right. I was actually I thought there was like another thing there, so I got a little I got a little trigger happy with Shine Spark in there, cause because I'm stupid though. I have no I had no reason to jump there. Okay. This is this is what I'm thinking. Okay, ready next one? And because you got Shine Spark over here to get to th this way here. Because, guess what? We're able to get to this area here. And notice how it's all red over here. It's, it's all kind of charred up here. Yeah. We're actually able to come back to this area to tour this area. And you may have noticed on the way out of Torian, there was a green door. Super Missile that. And we could actually take the elevator back into Torian. I bet y'all didn't think that this was actually going to be a thing, huh? Because I, I certainly did not expect this. So, and all the platforms are still here. They still crumble away very easily, though. But, but there's actually, there are speed booster blocks over here. And not really a good way to, to go across over there, this way. And also, there's a super missile block down this way here, underneath the mother brain tank, where there is a power bomb tank. Yeah. I know it's reminiscent of the of like a I think it was a missile I think it was a missile pack that was in the Super Metroid that was underneath the original Mother Brain to there, but yeah, so we actually are back in Mother Brain's chamber. And also for the record, that green that green liquid there is basically the very corrosive material. Not even the gravity will protect you from that. So what you want to do is try to spark this way here, up and and then shine spark across. If you hit if you hit the up button, if you hit like up when you're in shine when you're rolling there or, or, or you shoot, you actually go out of your spin jump form and if you jump again while midair, it'll activate the shine spark. So it's a, it's a pretty I know it's a pretty long winded explanation that I had to do just now, which was next to impossible to do while I was well trying to do it. So I So yeah, that's how you're supposed to do that though. You I think there's a way you can just jump across. Just do the jump across though, but if you hit something that's not breakable though, you lose your shine spark. It's just much easier to do it that way. Yeah, those are the only two upgrades that are hiding in that are well hiding in, in, in Torian. So keep that. Like I said, there was stuff we couldn't get got, we, that we couldn't have gotten there and until after we finished it because well up the countdown. And also, something else I want to point out as well. We need power bombs to blow parts part of this up here. And well, if you go down this little passage right here, there's a little detail that's kind of neat, though. Go across this way here, and then just jump down here. Go down this way here, and well, we are where we started in Brinstar. So yeah, there was it does show that little passage there, and also that there's a. I, I couldn't show what that is though. That's just like one, another one of those ball, morph ball launchers that would would send you back up that way. If you want to go back that way there, but now we've made it back to the main part of the planet. No, now we're back in. There's nothing in Brinstar for us. We've already cleared out Brinstar, so we're gonna head down to Crade's Lair because there is one upgrade that we could not get because we needed the gravity suit for it. And I believe it is. We gotta go this way. 
we gotta go this way here. I think is what we gotta do. Yes, it is. And so you wanna go up this way over here, and then you're gonna wanna go into the acid. You see there's a little a little bit of patch with the acid here, so shoot this stuff here and get your shine spark going, and then you wanna ball spark across this way. Actually wait. Okay. Now go across because Oh, I'm stupid. That's just the way to get out. Okay. So you want... Okay, so go, go across this way. Activate Shine Spark. Morph Ball ball Spark there. And go down here. Ball Spark across and just let it go across. So speed boost blocked for a missile tank over here. And that is the one upgrade that we couldn't that we couldn't have gotten here. Also, I think that's a speed booster block. Yes, it is. Like I said, it's a way for you to get out. So... I'm gonna see if I can go ahead and pull that off, though. So, I th I head down. What do you What do you sound telling me, game? I head down. Okay, so, go. And hurry, jump. I, I was a oh, oh, screw it. That's just a fast way out. Screw it. I'll take the normal way out. All right. So let's go back this way here. The fine game. You win. I'll do this. The I'll do this as a normal person would do this, not how someone who can speak run this game can do it. So now we're gonna go back. No, that's the wrong one. My bad. That's the wrong one. It's down here. And we got a hint of this earlier because, well, you go when you go through this way here. Okay, well, th that's the passage down there, which I didn't fully want to show there, but it works out a bit though because I could. It's, it's probably a faster way to get up this way here and you remember what in the save room here that had those screw attack blocks here so now we got screw attack let's go through this way here and we got ourselves a little passageway that connects to Norfair of all things and you need a power bomb to get through there as well okay so if you had screw attack before you need a power bomb to get through there so okay at least it's just a missile block and I and I assume missile by mistake for that though and there's a couple, there's a few of them here that I forgot about, that I couldn't get. One is down, there's a couple down here in the lava because we could, well, we couldn't really do anything with that because, well, it's lava. Okay, missile block that way, okay. I had it a bit wrong. Let's actually go back to missiles and not waste my super missiles. Because there's a little passage down here, that, we, and again, we couldn't have done this before without the gravity suit. It is, there is a way to theoretically do this. There is a way that that where you can theoretically do this, and well, in well, well, in on normal mode though, but it would take some tools to speed running though. There's ways to do this though, but but you didn't have enough health to get back out though. Is the thing, especially since over here, you got some missile blocks over here. You got you got to time your shots perfectly. With that though, consider that a little bit of practice for an upcoming thing there. And well, there's a power bomb tank hiding up here as well. Again, like there is a way to theoretically do it with like like I've seen tool assisted speedrunners be able to do this though, but there's like not enough HP to get out alive because the lava will kill you at that point. And so that's that's that little bit there, and well we have a little And that is not all the ones in that that's all the upgrades to, for us to get here in Torian, because well there's one that I forgot about. Well, actually like, there's one little passage that I did forget about. Down over here, yeah, there's a there's a there's a little door over here that I completely forgot about. This, so you could just go through them, and you could have done this earlier. Like I just I le I legit forgot about this one here. So, got a missile tank over there, and if we go go down further, there should be another missile tank. And I think that's it for Norfair. Let me just check there. Yeah, that is it for Norfair. We are done with Torian. Criteria, Brainstar, and Cray. So, so next up, next up on our little travel list, well, is Ridley's Lair. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut ahead to that point though, cause well, it's gonna take a little bit for me to get over there. So I'll spare y'all the backtracking. So I'll see y'all in just a moment. Okay, we are here in Ridley's Lair now, and we're back for that one missile tank. But there's a little. But while we're here, I'm gonna go ahead and showcase a little passage up here. A missile up this way here, and you can shoot. You can bomb jump your way up there if, if you're good, though. But I'm trying to 
I'm trying to get up here with my space jump, though, which is proving a little problem. Yeah. So if you go up there, and it creates a little chain over this way here, for a little passage over here. It's, a, it's another little sequence break trick where you can use this to bu actually bypass the boss and even skip super, and even skip the super missiles there if you didn't want it. Well, but if you really want to challenge yourself, I, I do not recommend that, though, but... Honestly, if you're going for low percentage runs, I would say as much as your spare items that you can get, get as many super missiles as you can. Okay, so we're going to have to do this little trick again. And as you can tell, I am not happy. Not happy with this at all, though, because, like I said, this was the miss. This is probably my least favorite missile tank in the game. So we're going to build the speed booster back up. Okay. I was somehow not doing that, so let's try this again. I did it right. I did it well the first time I was here, so why can't I do it now? All right, here we go. And up this way here and down. And across. Okay, here we go. And now let's build up this. Now that I've got the space <laughs> Okay. <laughs> now we got the space jump. We can hopefully do this much easier now. So, go up this way here and go up. And this time I don't have to race it as much though, because, well. I. No, 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 no. <sighs> How I love thee! Alright. Okay, finally, here we go, here we go. Oh, and also for the record, those were also fake blocks over there too. Ones that will basically crumble away after a while. In fact, I'll, let me go ahead and show you. Yep. So yeah, you even have to time it right there too, so. I hate that missile tank. That missile tank and... Well, but kind of is already easy. I was gonna say burning the deepest parts of Norfair, but Really's Lair is kind of lower Norfair, so. Alrighty, so. And why did I come back here? Why did I come back here? I had no reason to come back over here. I was thought, I guess that for some reason I thought I needed to, well, get, I had to come back over there. Well, that is everything in the planet. So I'm gonna head back to Chizodia now and Probably gonna have to get get like maybe one or two more expansions up over there, and and probably end this off here. So I'll see y'all in just a moment. Actually, one detail I forgot is w w back when we went over this way to go get the screw attack earlier, though. There's another one over here where it's, you, you another little morph ball launcher that you could have gotten here if you had already gotten screw attack. But I think I showed off the. I don't remember if I showed this one, but if you miss that one there, there's another hidden one here too, which means you can. Let's get the screw attack as well. So, act which that would just takes you up there. So this one will just send you back up this way here. One little thing I forgot. It was just one of those little things I forgot. That I forgot to bring up though. Like I, I think I may have talked about it, but I wanted to show it. That was that was a thing there. So, so now now for real, I'm gonna meet y'all back up at pretty much by Chizodia. Alrighty. So I just took the elevator back up to. Back to Norfair through, through Norfair up to Criteria. Now we're back in Chizodia, back the way we had came here initially, though. So now that we have that, I already, already went and got those upgrades earlier. So, but there is still one upgrade that we can get in this area down here that I want to show off here. Also, yeah, also those atomics, those things are atomics. That's what they're called. So, gonna destroy all these things here because they're, otherwise they're gonna get in the way. Because I've got to build up a speed booster for this, so. So let's do this. Speed booster, and down, and shine spark upward. So this way here, through and up to get an energy tank. So definitely worthwhile detour this way here. So, so but that is it that's in the... 
well, that is everything that is, well, in in all the areas over here. The only, th there's only, the only, the only thing that's, even the Chozo Ruins over there, so. The only, the only stuff that we got left to do is, well, here in the space pirate, in the pirate mother ship, so. So. Oh, get, get back up there. So, with that, so. There's only one thing left to do is clear out the, is clear out the pirate, is clear out the pirate ship. And see, because there's still a good bit we haven't explored here. And, and we still have to find our way out of here. So, until then, see you guys then. Thank you all for watching.